All right, we got a hole here. Innovative builders drilled for me. This is for running electric, running the GFI outside. And it's gonna be attached to this panel. I'll probably do it uh, right here in this next available slot. And this is the GFI breaker that I got. So we have ground and neutral, both go into the same bar. Okay, unfortunately I don't think I have a uh, Robertson's number two, so I'm just using a flathead. Let me get this guy right here. Right in here. Good and torque down. Now we will drape him down there. We got plenty of room to be a little sloppy. And just plug him in like that. Alright, so he's ready to receive the wiring. bring this wiring up from the bottom. So we're going to punch out. I think I'll do this one right here. Okay, we got a Remix connector here. Uh, 
Let's see, it's opened up enough. So that the wire will go through. Okay, this is gonna get installed on the bottom. Screws out. So it'll tighten it easily. Okay, so what I like about the Siemens, uh, they accept the larger um, screwdriver. Alright, now we got to run the wiring, decide how much we need. So I'm going to say we need about this much, just a guess. So, wiring too much, so we'll cut it off right about here. Hold on to the wiring so it doesn't flop back up. Alright, now let's hook up ground wire. Ground wire is too long. So we'll cut him and hold him at the same time. Installed. Next, we need neutral. is connected, push him behind all these wires. Okay, last one is the hut. Okay, the breaker is turned off. Always double check that. here to route it so it looks kind of okay. Alright, let's flip the breaker, see if we're okay. Okay, flip it again. I think we're good. Alright, so now we need to install the cover. Okay, and then I'm going to 
going to secure uh, this wiring right here. Okay, we're working. I'm going to hit the uh, button to test it. Here we go. Just tripped. So, perfect. Let's see, we're tripped. So, we'll turn it off. Turn it back on. Now we're armed. So, if you liked that video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. Most importantly, subscribe. Look for my other uh, videos coming out. I have a lot of videos. One is a big job I'm doing now, replacing a post on my uh, deck that's 17 feet in the air. So, thanks for watching. Okay, this services the kitchen refrigerator, stove. Kitchen. And oven. And this one that I installed is new. So this is the garage. Outlets. And this is rear. GFI. And this is garage lights. I noticed I have a buzzing, uh, I have a hum coming from the panel. I don't know if it's the main breaker or what, so I'm going to start tripping breakers until I begin to notice um, the hum go away. Right when I turn that breaker off, this breaker here. I think this might be a bad breaker. The humming stops, so let's turn every bra other breaker on. Okay, so the humming is not gone. But it's a different sound of hum now.
Okay, so I heard the uh, GFIs emit some humming, so that's okay. Let's turn every breaker on that is not GFI. Okay, no humming. So Okay, 15. So this top breaker and this breaker Okay, so I need to replace this 20 amp breaker and this 15 amp breaker. And what I'm going to do for the 15 amp breaker, since that is probably servicing an, an outlet or lights in the house, I'll replace that with an AFCI, GAFCI, which is a combination GFI and AFCI breaker, much like this one here. And then this one is a 20 amp. I'll replace that. I'll find out what it services. And then I'll replace that. So 20 amp I'm going to guess is either the bathroom or the kitchen. Most likely the kitchen. Okay, this services the kitchen refrigerator, stove. and oven and this one that I installed is new so this is the garage This is rear GFI. And this is garage lights.